Oxygen OS port based on Android Pie for the Xiaomi Poco F1 is back. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And guess what? Oxygen OS, the thread which is marked as abandoned at the time of recording this video, is back. A lot of peeps messaged or pissed off Code Elixir by bugging him or sending him PMs to fix bugs in his Oxygen OS port for the Xiaomi Poco F1. That irritated him and he quit the project but he is back a message for all of those impatient souls who cannot live with a few bugs the developers do this for free there are a few unsaid rules of XTA developers first one being do not ask for ETA second one being do not PM the developers with bugs they know bugs exist they try their best to fix it and if you have to report a bug make sure you report it with a log if you do not know how to take a log go ahead and google how to take a log cat and that will help you as well as the developers in fixing the bugs another thing to note is that the developers do this in their free time and for free so you are not entitled to anything and they are not obliged to fix the bugs that is my short and simple message and to code elixir well dude you're doing a great job but one thing which you need to learn is that you need to develop a thick skin. There will always be bad apples who will message you, who will say bad things, but you need to learn how to ignore those bad peeps and move along, do what you do best, which is port Oxygen OS to the Xiaomi Poco F1. That being said, let's go ahead and now see how you can install this latest Oxygen OS port on your Xiaomi Poco F1. What are the files which you need? So these are the four files which you need. You need the Oxygen OS port zip file, the vendor patch zip file, vendor.zip is the vendor patch zip file, disable force encryption, and the latest vendor firmware for the Xiaomi Poco F1. Links to all of these four files can be found in the description of this video. Once you've downloaded these four files, transfer them to your phone or you can directly download them on your phone. Once that is done, go into settings, go into lock screen and password and make sure you have removed all your pin, password, fingerprint, face unlock data which you have set up. Once that is done, go back, scroll down a little bit, go into me account and make sure you removed your me account as well. Once that is done, go back and click on sync and make sure you removed your Google account as well. We're doing this because we're going from MIUI 10 based on Android Pie to Oxygen OS based on Android Pie as well. The next thing you need to do is make sure that you have installed to Work Recovery on your Xiaomi Poco F1. I have a separate video for that which is linked in the description of this video and it will also pop up as a card on the top right of your screen. Also make sure that your battery is charged at least 70 to 80 percent and make sure you've backed up your data because we're going to do a factory reset of your device which means you will lose all your pictures, videos and any other important data which you have on your phone. Once you've confirmed all these things go ahead and turn off your Xiaomi Poco F1. Once you have turned your phone off, you need to press and hold the volume up button and the power button at the same time till you see the TwoUp Recovery boot logo. Once we are in TwoUp Recovery, we'll click on install and the first file which you need to install is the POCO F1 vendor firmware zip file which is Beryllium and the version number vendor hyphen firmware.zip. Select this guy and then swipe to confirm flash. Once vendor firmware has flashed successfully, click on the home button, click on wipe Click on advanced swipe and select Dalvik cache system and data and then swipe to wipe. Once the process has finished successfully, click on the home button, click on install and the next zip file which we need to install is the Oxygen OS GSI zip file. This guy over here, select it and then swipe to confirm flash. Once Oxygen OS ROM zip file has flashed successfully, click on the home button, click on install. And the next file which we need to flash is disable force encryption zip file. Select this guy and then swipe to confirm flash. Once disable force encryption zip file has flashed successfully, click on the home button, click on install. And the last file which we need to install is the vendor patch zip file, which is this guy over here, vendor.zip. Select it and then swipe to confirm flash. Once the process has finished successfully, click on the home button, click on wipe and then click on format data. 
type in yes do note this is where we are erasing all your pictures videos and everything so make sure you back those things up if you want you can go ahead and skip this step try booting without doing a format data and if it boots then it's good enough if it doesn't then you'll have to boot back into two up recovery and do a format data i'm doing it because i want my method to be foolproof and without any boot loops for my subscribers next we'll go ahead and click on the check mark button once the process has finished successfully all we need to do is click on reboot system and wait for the oxygen os boot animation and bam there we have it oxygen os boot animation in the building on a xiaomi poco f1 which means we have successfully installed oxygen os based on android pi on a xiaomi poco f1 the first boot up will take some time so you need to be patient that's it for this video peeps i hope my video helped you and make sure you respect the developers do not bug them with unnecessary messages or pms likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you